Guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Omega Ruby walkthrough. Okay, so, yeah, we went straight to the Shoal Cave. Sorry if I called it the Icefall Cave, my bad, guys. And, well, it's still at high tide, so we're gonna have to wait a while for that to go down. Shoot, we might not even go in there when it's low tide. I don't even know. Don't care! So in this episode right here, we're going to be battling the gym leaders at Moss Deep City. And, well, we brought in an old face to help us in this little, uh, in this little conquest right here. Ladies and gentlemen, Noob Saibot. If you guys don't remember Noob Saibot, we kind of replaced Raiden for Noob Saibot towards the very end of our Emerald version walkthrough, through. And, uh, homie here is actually pretty good. Yeah, it's a very, very good physical attacker, so, yeah. This next gym right here is uh, all psychic type Pokemon. I don't want to mess with that. So we got to take extra precaution right here. So let's see. Must Deep City Gym leaders, Lisa, or Liza and Tate, the mystic combination. You don't say. Alrighty. Maximum effort right here. So as you can see, it's all mystic looking and everything. Talking to the old man who's ever believed in us. He's like, yo, how is it going, champ to be, Draven? The gym leaders here use psychic type Pokemon. If you go up against them with fighting or poison type Pokemon, you'll do they'll do horrible damage to your Pokemon. They'll come at you with outstanding combination attacks. If you want to win, you'll need to show them uh, how tight you are with you and your Pokemon. Go for it. Alright, for the tacos. Let's do this for the tacos. So, let's see. I'm going to be switching out my Pokemon right now. I'm going to go with a... Uh, well, new Saibot right here, and if you guys, well, you guys can't really see, but I do have Raiden here with me as well, just uh, just in case, you know, for a little coverage and all that stuff, and look at that, we're hovering around, and we're going to be going up against this guy right here. Battles hinge on the strength of your, uh, your spirit. The weak-spirited will never win. Oh yeah? How much you want to bet? Here we go, going up against Psychic Preston, and he will be coming out with his Kadabra. Oh, damn. He's going with the strong Pokemon first. So let's go, Gaia the Fierce Knight. And off screen, I did teach him a good move. A very, very good move. And, well, it's going to be one hit KO. Trust me on this one. Here we go, Shadow Kamehameha. Oh, yes. Shadow Kamehameha does the trick. Oh, yes. Starting to, uh, starting to learn a little bit more of their physical and special attributes and all that stuff. And, yeah... Just realize that, you know, especially at this age right now, Gaia the Fierce Knight right here, the Guard Devourer, it is a special attacker. The, well, the other Gaia is not a special attacker. It's a physical one. You guys taught me that one when I was in Platinum version. So let's move on right here. And, well, let's go straight up here and get floated over to this guy right here. I don't know how many uh, people we're going to have to fight, so let's go right ahead and switch out to... Noob Shibot. And, well, let's see. There is a little something here that I need to do as well. Just in case we kind of do it. Hold on just a sec. Alakazinite. And Maynek Tray. Oh, wait. We can give that to this guy right here. Alright, so you're now holding that. And... Could have sworn I had it here. Could have sworn I hit it here. Eh, well, what do you know? Oh yeah, no, I don't have it. Okay, so never mind. I was thinking of X version. All right, let's do this. Maximum effort. I can't get enough of the way you go floating up softly in this gym. Okay, alrighty. So here we go, going up against Psychic Joshua. Joshua. And he will be coming out with his uh, Kadabra right here. So let's go, Noob Saiba. It's our first battle back in Pokemon Omega Ruby. And, well, let's go right ahead and just power you up a little bit. Here comes that telekinesis. Oh, crud. We are floating. But here we go. Powering up our attack. Oh, yes. We're going we're, we're, we're gonna to destroy people right now with Shadow Claw. Oh, yes. Yep, yep, yep. Look at that. Easy, easy. Noob Saibot getting experience points, doing what it did best in Pokemon Emerald, and it's learning Psycho Cut. Look at that. Let's see. Um, let's see. It's another physical attack. Screw it. 
Eh, let's take away Sword Dance for the time being, because it actually has a strain. I will be switching it out, doing everything, and you know, that kind of stuff. And look at that, Raiden at level 43, Hydra 2, level 57, and here comes Metacham. Yeah, we're going to have to switch out Pokemon right here. So let's go straight to the man. Let's go to the man that uh, New Saibot replaced. Let's go with Raiden, the Lord of Thunder. Okay, Lord of Thunder. Prove to your compatriot that you don't like him. Let's go, Wild Charge. Yeah, look at that. Well, it takes half its HP. A little bit of recoil, but here comes that high jump kick. And bam. Wow. That wasn't smart. It really wasn't. Okay, so let's go back to Desert Storm. If you guys may remember, this guy is a PIMP? PIMP, I think I should say. Yes, and here we go. Fly attack. And what the hell? Acupuncture. Now it's wiggling. It's doing its thing. Thinking it can beat me, but here we go. Fly attack does the trick. Suck on those lemons. Alrighty, okay, everybody's experience points going up, that's good. Yeah, we kind of need to heal our Pokemon right now because, yeah, that was not a good showing for a what's-his-face. Uh, yeah, Raiden. Come on, man, you gotta use that pimp hand. You gotta prove to, uh, you gotta prove to Noob Zybot that you, you were the man for the job in the last episode. I mean, you did win the, 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 what you might call it, the Sinnoh League at one point. Now, if you press this, this will actually switch off and go to, straight to that eerie little girl. So let's go straight, okay, where do we go? Oh, we can't go there. Okay, so let's go right here. Oh, damn. Everywhere you go... People want to know. <laughs> Watch me levitate a Pokeball telekinetically. <laughs> Sometimes I'm out of sync. Okay, alrighty. Alrighty, so here we go. Psychic Fritz wants the battle. And, well, he, he's coming out with a take of a Pokemon named Claydol. So let's go, Noob Sabot. Alrighty. And look at that pressure right there. And, well, let's go with the Night Slash right here. But here we go with the Power Split. Ah, oh, crud. And here we go. Night Slash. Nearly does it. Let's go. Or Shadow Claw. What the hell is it doing? Guard Switch? Okay, so you probably screwed up right there. Don't know why you did that. So goodbye, Claydol. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy, look at that. And, well, Psychic like Fritz is coming out with a Starmie. You guys already know how I feel about that. So, let's go straight to Raiden to redeem itself. Let's go. Alrighty, okay, alright. Let's go, Raiden. Redeem yourself. Starmie. Or, you know, Patrick, the old Pokemon that we had. Didn't do us any good, and here we go. Discharge. Finish him. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Who's the king of the jungle now? That's right, that's right. Raiden is. And Fritz defeated. <laughs> yeah, your whole Pokemon battle skills are out of sync as well. So let's press this. And yes, this will actually take us somewhere. Let's see, hold on. We got two areas to go to. Let's go down. Yeah, let's go down and talk to this girl right here. And she's like... I'm from Mount Pyre. Taste the power of my Pokemon, and I have attained in a place of spirits of Pokemon slumber. Oh, damn. It's kind of scary right here. So here we go. Hexmania Kindra wants the battle coming with her Curlia. Remember, guys, it's a, it's a fairy type as well. So here we go. Let's get this. Okay, so I think I might be at a disadvantage right here. I could be. No worries, let's go with the strength attack, and, wow, it with, she withdrew her Pokemon. Coming out with Grumpig. Alright, Grumpig, eat this strength attack. Oh, yes. Not much, but it's something, so here we go. Night Slash. Oh, yes. And Night Slash does the trick. Say goodbye to that big old bacon. Oh, yes, bacon. Back on. And Sage has... Growing another level right there, and she's going to be coming out with a Curlia. So I'm going to be better prepared for this guy now. 
Let's go with Hydra 2. Yes, our most strongest Pokemon right now. Hydra 2. Alrighty, Shiny Red Gyarados. You can't stop it. You can't stop it. Alrighty. And there's that Intimidate attack. That goes down. And here we go. Surf attack for the win. Oh, yes. Curly, I had no chance. Nothing. Nothing. And everybody else gains experience points. Kindred has been defeated. Yes, I am so powerful. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, so let's see. Where does this lead? All right, it goes back to this guy. And, well, let's go straight to this guy right here. And... Okay. Hopefully she did Okay, she didn't see me. But this one will actually go straight to the gym leader. And, well, we're going to have to battle this girl anyways. I'm getting on an ominous feeling from you. Or about you. Okay, about me. So, let's go. Hexmaniac Patricia wants to come out with a Chimiko. I wonder if that Pokemon could, uh, could actually evolve or something. I don't know. I can't. Uh, it could. It couldn't. I don't even know. Why even bother? So, let's go. Shadow Claw. For the win. Yeah, buddy. And it's causing an uproar. Good God. Alrighty. So, Ch Chimiko growing, uh, doing an uproar. So, let's go Night Slash. For the win. No more Chimeko. Chimeko, Chimiko, Chimiko. I don't even know how to pronounce his name either. That's how I got that Pokedex Pro thing. And look at that. Noob Saibot grows level 39. Everybody's growing levels. And Patricia has been defeated. Yes, sir. I am a dominant. Okay, so let's see. Eh, screw it. I'm going to have to go down here anyways. Okay. Let's see what this guy has to say. Let me see your talent. Okay. And here we have another psychic. His name is Virgil, and he's coming with this cadaver right here. Okay, new Sabbat. Let's go. And of course, no pressure whatsoever, but here we go. Let's go with a night slash. And yes, you gotta love the telekinesis. Don't know why that would lift me up to the air, but here we go. Night slash does its trick. No more cadabra. And bam, look at that. And Virgil's coming out with a giraffe rig, so we're just gonna stay put right here. Let Noob Saba try and go to level 40 right here, so let's go another Night Slash. But here comes that Crunch attack, good god. Oh Jesus, very powerful attack. So let's go, Night Slash does its trick, nearly beats him. Okay, let's go Strength. And crud, that double hit attack is really getting on my nerves. So that's just two times. Noob Saibot survives, and here goes. Strength attack does its thing. Yes, sir. Look at that. Noob Saibot grows to level 40. Yes, sir. Alrighty. And everybody else is getting experience points just because we're awesome like that. And who is messaging me at this hour? I don't know. Okay, so let's see. That is that. Let's see, where would this take me? Oh, it's taking me to. I think I've already... Hold on. Hold on just a sec before he starts battling me. There we go. You love my Pokemon. And... If this is... Okay, so in Decisive Lose, that's my warning to you. Okay, so that's not much of a warning right there. Alrighty, so let's go straight forward right here. I think this... Yep, it's gonna take us to the gym leader. And I'm here, baby. Okay. So, as many of you guys already know, the gym leader's here. It's not one gym leader, it's two gym leaders. And because Hoenn is the home to, whatchamacallit, uh, double battles, they actually included a double battle gym leader battle right here. And so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go with two of my strongest Pokemon and just continue on right here. Ah, look at that. We're in like a psychic waterfall right here. So freaking awesome. Okay, what do you have to say, girls? Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> Were you surprised? They're both talking in sync. That's... That's... There are two gym leaders? We're twins! Oh, damn. 
we don't need to talk because we can tell we can each tell what each other is thinking oh damn all in our minds oh damn you guys are creeping me out this combination of ours can you beat it oh damn they're gonna fuse they're gonna fuse the fusion dance oh damn Okay, so here it is guys, gym battle number seven, Liza and Tate, and they're going to be coming out with their uh, Pokemon Lunatone and Solrock right here. Alright, time to come out with some pretty good Pokemon myself. Oh yes, Sage of the Halo. I think, Sage of the Halo, Sage of the Halo. Yes, Sage of the Halo. And Hydra 2, and you know what? It's time. I think it's time, guys, to do what we should have done in quite some time. I know you guys have been waiting for it for ever since we got it, but it's time. Bam! It's time. Surf attack for the win. We're going to use the Mega Evolution. Oh, yeah. Look at this guy. Looking like a big old piece of shrimp that I can't eat. And now it's using its Mold Breaker, and here comes the X Scissor. Oh, yes, that's one. Here's a two combination. Eat this surf attack. And that's how you take care of that. Oh, yes. So once you make it evolve a Pokemon, their power just grows. It's like big. It's like legendary Pokemon status right there. And look at that. Our Pokemon growing levels like crazy. And Gaia number, or Gaia number one. And... <laughs> Oh my god! That's it, guys. That's it. That's what Mega Evolution does. Just destroys the Pokemon Gym Leaders. Oh yeah! It can't be helped! You've won! So take this in recognition. Oh yes, look at that, guys. Our seventh badge. The Mind Badge. Even though it looks like a heart. The Mind Badge has the power to make all Pokemon up to level 80, including yours that you receive during uh, other people obey you. It also enables Pokemon to use the HM move called Dive. And take this too. Look at that, guys. We get ourselves a TM04 called Mind. Called Mind. Comes from relaxing your mind and concentrating Pokemon's special attack and special defense. Will be heightened by this move. It's a perfect move for psychic Pokemon. Looks like there's a bond between you and your Pokemon far stronger than the bond we share as twins. But you'll go on from here to form even more bonds. That's the future I see for you. There may be harsh or it may be a harsh ordeal ahead of for you and your Pokemon, but that's all right. You and your Pokemon aren't alone. You have each other. That's why we want you to face whatever troubles may come your way head on and full of courage. Damn. Alrighty. Feeling like a pimp? Got ourselves our next badge? Hell yeah. And look at that. We use the instant transmission coming back right here. Let's see what the homeboy has to say. Wow, you're astonishingly, or you're stunning. You're one great trainer. Okay, alrighty. So once you step outside the Moss Deep City gym, bam, that happens. Okay, so <laughs> what the hell happened? What? 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 A, a pillar of light appeared from the sea. That direction is, is that direction of one, Route 128? Whoa, dude! Seriously, dude! <laughs> this is the end of the world. Skinny, don't get worried. Don't worry. Calm down. Skinny. The hell? Oh damn, something happened. Whoa, that was like a total shocker. What the heck was that? That was a f big fat pillar of light. It totally came out from here, didn't it? Draven. I heard from a little t or little Liza and Tate that you visited their gym. I was thinking you're trying to catch, uh, trying to catch uh, you while you were in this in the area, but then this happened. We should talk. Let's go to my place. 
Oh damn, something big is going down. Oh wait, you lived right here? Oh shit. Oh, what's up? It's okay, alright, oh, cool. And, well... He's like, ah, yes. I suppose I, I should welcome you to my home. Please forgive me rather, uh, uh... Please forgive the rather sparse decor. Now, where, where to begin? Let us take a moment to understand what is happening to our world right now. The rumbling that shook the earth just now. The eardrum rupturing explosion we heard. They are proof that a seal which has long been long hidden deep under sea has been undone at last. The super ancient Pokemon that has been sealed deep beneath Route 128 since its ancient times. It slept until now in the uh, in the sea floor the sea floor cavern. The entrance that the cover the cavern was sealed by the Pokemon uh, or the power of the certain Pokemon, all in effort to keep any human or Pokemon from ever reaching it. But now it appears that the, the scheming of that terrible team has undone the seal. There's no doubt that the, they intend to revive the super ancient Pokemon. And once they do so, it seems they hope to make, make its power their own. Draven. If that team obtains the power of the super ancient Pokemon, it will upset the balance of nature in this world. A crisis unlike any other before it will befall every living thing on this planet. I plan to do everything in my power to quell the, this nature or this situation. That is my duty. But there is a limit to what I can do with my power alone. That is why I'm asking for your help. I have a great faith in your abilities. Lend me your strength to help uh, help put a halt to these teams and mad mission. With you and I are and our Pokemon all working together, we will overcome the, this disastrous turn of events. I don't think it is out of our question. I will entrust you with this. We get ourselves the HM07 die finally. Oh, back to the back to the serious song right there. Holy crap! If you use dive, you will be able to drive to dive the ocean or the ocean floor with your Pokemon, and take this so you can uh, stay with your po your Pokemon even in the depths of the ocean. We get ourselves the Devon Scuba Gear. Hell yeah! If you if you were to use dive in the correct stretch of water along Route 128. I believe you should uh, be able to reach the entrance of the seafloor clack the seafloor clack cavern. Wow, can't even say that right. I will join you when I finish my duties. Please do what you can to stop Team Aqua and Magma. Until then, I am trusting you to do this for me. Oh, damn, things got real serious real quick. Okay, so I'm gonna step outside and uh, process everything that just happened. So now, we're going to have to save the world again, because, well, nobody else can. And, uh, well, that's going to take place in the next episode. Yeah. And thankfully, we've already crossed Route 128, so we already know where it's at. And, uh, well, I hope you guys are ready for this one. It's going to be a fun adventure. Very, very fun. Especially the battle against Groudon, too, so, yeah. Can't wait for that one right there. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.